All right, so some of you guys may have seen my channel before and I've kind of been obsolete for a little while. Kind of pretty much HoloLens development for the last year, pretty much exclusively for the most part. And the problem is, is that I take my experiences to different showcases and people are really interested in it, but then they find out how much a HoloLens costs. So I was trying to find an affordable way to showcase some of my applications uh, that a mass community could pick up and, and play with, you know, and and I don't really like augmented reality just on the cell phone on the screen, uh, much like you know the popular Pokemon game. But the Hololens is is an expensive device that uh, I think presents a really high quality augmented reality experience. And if you know anything about Hololens or or augmented reality devices. The, view, the viewing lens is really small. And I wanted to test out this hollow kit here. And I've already broken the seal, but I haven't seen what's inside of this yet. Um, I actually ordered this on Amazon and shipped by Amazon, fulfilled by Amazon. Sold, excuse me, sold by another company. This is uh, the hollow kit. Um, and I needed it in kind of in a hurry because I'm trying to uh, do an application with this device. I wanted to kind of play around with it and see how it works. And if it looks really cool so first off I'd like to say for being a, a cardboard device uh, by the way I'll link this uh, in the description below of where you can pick this up uh, on hollow kits website and on Amazon and by the way I'm not sponsored by this this is just me as a augmented reality developer that's really interested in it to showcase what this device really is and that way you can make your own decision there's other devices out there that you could pick up uh, and it was almost $60 to import it from another country uh, I won't specify their name until I get that device and check it out and see for myself. I don't know anything about this, but uh, you can definitely pick it up on Amazon for like 35 bucks, or you could get it for free if you're a developer uh, and agree to their terms and conditions. So, uh, first off, we get a piece of paper here, and it's, it says Hollow Kit, and I'll put it to where you guys can read it. Hopefully, that's in focus. So I actually have a uh, Note 5, uh, and I thought that this was a device that did not work with the Note, but from my surprise, you can actually fit this phone in there pretty nicely. Um, I don't know how it looks yet, um, but um, I can definitely put it up in there, and we'll close that off. But it looks like I just need to make a little cut here for my camera. So let me do that real fast and I'll be right back to show you that. Okay, I am back and it didn't take very long. I was just three, three or four minutes. Uh, and I just kind of followed the guide here for the most part for their Asus. I don't know if I need to cut out a spot for my uh, lens or not, or my uh, flash, but um, I, my camera, I assume, is important so for, for tracking or whatever I may use this for. Um, but yeah, it, I would say this is pretty cool that my phone actually fits in here. Now the question is, does it work with it? And uh, I'll, I think I'll make a separate video of me just playing around with it. Uh, again, down in the, in the description below, you'll see a link for my augmented reality HoloLens applications and, uh, you know, maybe some links or uh, some links for this product itself. Uh, and I'll even link the Amazon and all that stuff down below, like I said before. So the other cardboard application I was talking about is a, as a device called the Horizon. And on screen, you're seeing a couple images of what I got from their website. I was able to boot up the Horizon application on my Note 5 and put it in the cardboard and actually get clean uh, visuals. Though I do not have the Horizon uh, tracking puck that they send with it, a little cardboard uh, puck. But I was going to actually try to uh, print out a, a quality image of the puck and then try that out just to see how this works. I would have bought the Horizon device, but since they're a UK company and I am in the United States, it would have costed me almost 60 or 70 bucks to import that in, buying the device and it getting it imported in. 
So it didn't really make sense for me to buy that, and that's why I went with the Hollow Kit because it is in the United States. But just so you know, if you do pick up a Hollow Kit for the the ease of it, you can definitely at least attempt to use a Ryzen, and I'll update you with another video later with uh, my development process and how this thing's going. Um, it might not be for another couple weeks to a month, but uh, just stay tuned and, and definitely keep uh, on the. Uh, forms and stuff about augmented reality because I'm sure you'll see these things pop up a lot more. Uh, there's another one out there. I forget the name of it, but uh, that one's more of a Google Cardboard type experience uh, where it uses your camera. It's uh, inside out uh, viewing, so you're actually just recording your environment into a, a virtual reality kind of cardboard headset. So uh, these two are the ones that are stands out to me. So. Uh, Thank you guys for watching, and I hope you guys keep developing more op applications for augmented reality because we got to keep this thing going.